What's up everyone? Step one, my nuts itch. Step two, I'm taking this shit one day at a time. Step two, epidemic. Pokemon Go, that shit is everywhere. It's seeping into the waters, it's polluting my lifestyle, it's changing life as I know it. And you know who's playing this shit too. Oh shit, a Charmander! Hmm. They're all looking down at their phones, and I don't know what it is, because I mean, they could be using Google Maps, maybe they're checking Madonna's Twitter page, I don't know, or Osama's Instagram. You just know who's playing this shit. There's just something about it, like maybe the way they're walking, they're always like slouched over a little bit, just walking like, heh. <laughs> Pokemon. And they're always in their little pokey gangbanger group of like four people. And they don't even talk to the people that they're with. That's depressing. So the other day, I was skating to the park. Okay, not- I made this video a month ago, so I know this video is really late. Like, it's at least a month late. I'm remaking it now. A month ago, I was skating to the park. I was looking down at my phone using Google Maps trying to navigate my way around town, right? And this big Mexican dude, his fat friend, they drove by and they leaned out the window. Hey, are you playing Pokemon Go? And I was not, so I said no. And they just bolted down the street. They fled down that street like I'm a terrorist or something. It was weird. So weird. Almost as weird as enslaving midget laborers to celebrate Jesus' birthday. Fun fact, Santa was the first slave owner. The more you know. So they just bolted down the street. That dude stomped on the gas. You don't play Pokemon Go? He's not infected. He's normal. We gotta get the fuck out of here. And they were gone. All right, so later on, I was skating down the street all alone. It's getting pretty dark. And I look ahead and there's a car parked in the middle of the street, just idling, waiting for me to skate by. And it was getting dark. I thought it was pretty sketchy because I've actually been followed by a car at 12 o'clock at night while I was walking home by myself. My asshole still hasn't recovered from that encounter. So I was a little iffy, but then I said fuck it. I just skated by really fast. Pretty hesitant, expecting some big, buff, black guys to jump out the car, stuff me in the trunk, and just smuggle me across the border and like sell me for parts or something. Sell me as a slave into a life of gigolo hood. I'm not ready to go back to that life. So I skated by and I looked in and there were just four hipsters. And I don't know how I knew, but... They were all playing Pokemon Go. They stopped the car to fucking catch a Growlithe or a Squirtle or some shit. They were just all looking at their phones, trying to scare me, thinking there's some gangbangers ahead of me. Damn. And it's just little kids playing Pokemon. Dudes looking like Scooby-Doo. Except they didn't have a dog. But that ugly bitch could have been Scooby. I just killed a hooker. And I'm not saying Pokemon Go is bad or anything. I'm just saying it is an epidemic. It's an outbreak. Now let's not forget about that AIDS epidemic or the Ebola outbreak, the Ebola epidemic. And I'm not saying Pokemon Go is bad or anything, I'm just saying Pokemon Go, AIDS. Pokemon Go, Ebola, epidemic, you decide, Asian person, swag. I know this video is late. I made this video a month ago, it just, it really sucked. Hopefully it's better. No, it, it is better. Even if it's not good, it's better than what it was a month ago. I could have hopped on that bandwagon and gotten famous just having the word Pokemon Go in my video description, but it's too late for that now.